السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Another day, another video about Christian Prince and his lies Let's, let's check it out, let's see what he has to say uh, This is the Muslim translation The hour, the judgment is night Which means very, very close And the moon is a cleft ascender So Muhammad reporting to us what? The judgment day has already started Here we go, the moon split Muhammad, he saw the eclipse he claimed that this is judgment day. Something big happened at that time, which is big eclipse. And Muhammad, he think that that's, this is a sign of judgment day. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, that makes a lot of sense. I mean, that's how I feel. Um, every time I see an eclipse, I, I, I assume that it's just the moon splitting. <laughs> okay, so this is the first slide by CP. Absolutely no sense. He's interpreting... A verse in a way that conflicts with the text and he's just lying to the caller that's calling him up now Muhammad yeah. he Muhammad he claimed here to be a prophet and he prophesied about judgment day is in the corner and that was 1400 years and he claimed that this is the start of judgment day is not just coming it started because the moon split okay so the, the second thing here is we can see um, CP is actually claiming that the Prophet, peace be upon him, said that Judgment Day started. This never happened. Rasulullah has never said that Judgment Day started. There are multiple verses in the Quran that clearly indicate that the Rasulullah doesn't know when Judgment Day is going to start. So this is another lie by CP. So why didn't why did why didn't those believers leave their religion? What they are leaving, they are leaving. If you give them a chance to leave, there's many people who find out the truth. But if you live in the Middle East, they will kill you if you leave Islam. But there wasn't that many followers in that time, so. my friend. Yeah, didn't, didn't you hear about the war of apostate? Okay, so this is the third and final lie that I caught in this video. There are probably more, but I mean, this is what I caught, this is what I noticed. Um, as we can see, the caller. Subhanallah actually asks a good question and he simply says um, if this was if, if judgment day didn't occur at the time and uh, the prophet peace be upon him was exposed for this false prophecy um, and remember keep in mind that uh, Rasulullah apparently according to CP thought that the moon split when in reality was an eclipse I mean this enough would have been this, this in itself would have been enough to completely destroy the Prophet Sallallahu claim of being a prophet if he, was a, if he was a false prophet. You should have had mass apostasy. CP claims, well, the Muslims, excuse me, excuse me, um, anyone who disregarded Islam at that time would have been killed. And CP knows, he knows very well that this occurred in Mecca when the Muslims were a minority and were being targeted by the oppressive pagans. And no, the easiest thing in the world would be to leave your religion. You wouldn't be killed for leaving Islam. There was no um, apostasy law at the time either. So, la, CP, that's your third lie. I'm not lying to you, my friend. People are watching me by hundreds. And if I am lying, people will make fun of me.